have a little surprise queued up for you. Oh, oh let's check it out. Ready? M. Night Shyamalan is an American Indian award-winning auteur who is well known for his supernatural eerie films such as The Sixth Sense, Split, and many more. His interest in film peaked at a young age when he was gifted a Super 8 camera by his father, which ultimately led him to pursue a film degree at New York University. He is a jack of all trades as he funds his own films, writes them, produces them, and directs them. Shyamalan doesn't stop there and he also appears in all of his own films, excluding The Visit and After Earth. Is M. Night Shyamalan in Unbreakable? Yes! Is M. Night Shyamalan in The Sixth Sense? Yes! Is M. Night Shyamalan in Split? I am, I am not in Split. I don't think I am. Shyamalan has a very distinct directorial style and you can spot the use of shallow focus in all of his work. The reason he does this is to emphasize the character's moment of anagnorisis and to bring the audience closer to the character. He also often uses deep focus to tell a multi-layered story. An example of this is seen in Science where Meryl reads a pamphlet in the foreground, the children play in the background, and in the middle ground, the father ponders his recent alien encounter. M. Night Shyamalan loves to explore the human psyche and get creative by making mental illness even more disturbing by blending it with supernatural elements. He has created many mentally ill characters over the years, including Kevin from Split, the grandparents from The Visit, and Cole from The Sixth Sense. The idea Shyamalan tries to provoke is that sometimes human behavior is even more disturbing than the supernatural. Shyamalan loves to create suspense and often does so by putting his protagonists in peril and his characters are often held hostage. He does this to keep the audience on the edge of their seats and he also minimizes editing the takes to ensure that they are long and suspenseful. Some examples of this trope include the family held hostage and knock at the cabin, the villagers being stuck in the village, and the kids being stuck in the basement in the visit. If you find this footage- My name is Mitchell. <laughs> Shyamalan often has a symbolic color story in his films. For example, in The Village, good is represented by the color yellow, and bad is represented by red. Similarly, in The Sixth Sense, Shyamalan utilizes the color red to connect to the idea of death, and whenever red is shown on screen, you can expect a ghost to be present. Shyamalan films are not complete until the underlying plot is revealed. He does an excellent job at diverting the audience with supernatural elements and cohesively blending the separate plots. He loves a big reveal and he makes sure to foreshadow the reveal throughout each of his films. My favorite example is the one from The Sixth Sense in which the end of the film shows us that the character we have been following has been dead the entire time. Another fantastic reveal comes from the film The Visit. Listen to me. We are. Those aren't your grandparents. Shyamalan certainly works with some talented actors, and some frequent collaborators include Joaquin Phoenix, James McAvoy, Samuel L. Jackson, and Bruce Willis. Overall, Shyamalan's work can be described as suspenseful, deceitful, and shocking. He perfectly blends the supernatural elements into intricate plots and utilizes camera angles to add to the enigma of his films. Shyamalan is a brilliant auteur and I highly recommend watching one of his films. <laughs>